Hello YouTube, this is Mike, your host, and you're tuning into Mike Mon's channel. Today we're gonna learn how to approve comments, the likely spam comments and comments which are held for review. Make sure you are logged into your channel. On your web browser, after the forward slash, type the word comments, press the enter key. You will be directed to the comments section of your channel. The comments section contains three different sections, the public, held for review, and likely spam. For the public section, it contains all the comments of your videos which are publicly readable by other users. The held for review section, as you can see, these comments are held automatically by YouTube allowing you to review comments of the different users. Now, YouTube provides you with the following buttons. The approve button, the remove button, the report spam or abuse button, and the hide user from channel button in this particular comment. Now, after the review, if the comments is okay and fine, click the approve button so that this comment will appear on the corresponding video. Let's click the approve button. There you go. The comment is now being approved. On the likely spam section, the same with the help for review section provides also the four similar buttons. The approve button, the remove button, the report spam or abuse button, and the hide user from channel. Now. If this comment is fine, all you have to do is to approve this comment so that it will be removed from the likely spam section. Let's approve this comment. The comment is now being approved and it is being removed from the likely spam section. Let's go back to the held for review. There is another comment. Let's approve this one because the comment is fine. Now, all the comments which are held for review are now being approved and the same with the likely spam comments are now being approved. Congratulations, you have successfully approved the help review and likely spam comments on your channel and it's now available on the public section all right that's all and i hope you learn from this tutorial